Yo, 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 what is up, everybody? It's your boy, Quickie Nog, back for a Legend of Zelda video. I'm hyped about it, man. I told you I'm so excited about this. Alright, so, today, for our adventure, we're going to be getting some items that are going to help us in the first dungeon. Because we don't want to just rush in unprepared. Let me kill some of these baddies first. Actually, let me show off a cool, neat trick I learned after playing this game quite a while. If you leave all but one enemy on a screen and you come back, guess how many enemies you have. You have one, as opposed to killing them all and they refresh. That's just a quick time-saving little help type thing, if you know what I mean. Alright, so first, we're going to be going to get some heart containers. So what you're going to do is, from the start screen, I already went over one screen, but you're going to want to go over four total. So this makes two. Here we got some blue tektites. Little jumpy enemies. Uh, they don't scare us. Ooh, I'm going to take them out just because they give us good monies. The tektites are actually really nice for money. Like, if you ever need money, just go back and forth and just start wailing at these guys. Uh, and then sometimes that crap happens. You can't even get to the money. So first, what we're gonna... Ooh, get back, get back, get back, get back, get back, get back. I said back, back, back. I swear, don't kill me right here at the beginning. Okay, you're gonna wanna bomb that area. See this one right next to the wall? Take any one you want. Gee, this is tough. I can have a bottle or a heart container. HEART CONTAINER! I got it. Alright. Now what we're gonna wanna do, just for the sake of crap being easier... Oh, get away from me. Stop it. Stop, 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 stop. Get away. Oh yeah. I'm already at 52. Rupees are a little hard to come by in this game. Uh, there's some secret areas where you can get rupees that I'll show on, or show off, I guess, here in a bit. Get away. Uh, yeah. But for the sake of traveling, most of my memories come from the starting area, so it's easier to kind of, you know, see the locations in my mind if I start from here. I do have a come. Oh, that was not nice. I do have some of them written down. Uh, the ones that are just a little weird that I wouldn't always remember. Uh, so if I take a break, it's because I'm looking at my notes here, trying to be better prepared. So right here, we're going to go north five screens. Okay, I definitely did this wrong. Oof. Alright, alright. I guess I... Okay, yeah. I did mess up in my notes right here. The first one was easy, because it's like, okay, this is the first heart container you get. Like... It's not that hard to forget, but then from there, because uh, some websites, uh, oh, also that stops the clock, like all the uh, people on the screen stop moving, but it only works for one screen. All right, here, this is where I was. You go up four screens, get away. One, two, also stay on the right side. It's important that you stay on the right side. That way you can be here. Alright, so we're to the blue levers. We're gonna go up one more, and then we're gonna wanna go to the- Oh, get away from me. Please don't make me die. And we're gonna go to the right. Get back. And I think we're gonna wanna bomb this spot right here. Yeah. Yeah, that's what you get, boy! Don't step to me. And ta-da! We get a bottle- No, I'm just kidding. We get a heart container! All right, and while we're here, real quick, get back, get back, get back. Sorry, I said that a lot. It just it goes with the whole type of the game. All right, we are going to ooh, travel with the blue path. I know I'm supposed to do that. Hmm. Yeah, this part. I think. Okay, okay. I think I get it. I think I get it. So this part you want to keep going up, like it'll it'll look like you're not getting anywhere. I think for about four or five screens, but then you hear, oh no, I went too far. Yeah, that's the dungeon. I'm not going there. That's not where I'm trying to go. 
I think I'm going here. Oh, yes, here we go. I had to go left at the wrong spot. This right here, the blue guy is a Lionel. I would not get in his line of path, considering he does a whole heck of a lot of damage. Uh, you'll recognize him from Breath of the Wild if you play. He's kind of a pain if you're not prepared. Master using it, and you can have this. Uh, dirt face. And believe it or not, uh, we've only not even had this sword for one entire episode. And we're already getting rid of it in exchange for the white sword. And oh, 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 see, look at that, dude. He freaking, he'll wail on you. Oh, get the back. Also, there's a very good chance I die. I'm just trying to get rupees and hearts right now. Oof. Alright, I'm gonna wanna go back to the starting screen. Actually, nope, I gotta get 60 rupees for this. Blue candle, y'all heard of it? If you haven't, you gotta have 60 rupees for it. And right now, I'm at 52. And I was planning on doing getting them before the video, but I didn't know how long that would take. I thought I might be able to get them, you know, as I was playing through this. Okay, maybe going down doesn't work the same way. Yeah, going down does not work the same way. I would advise taking either a left or a right. Oh, is it this? I don't, some of this stuff is so confusing. It's not like you have, you know, limitations of the, um, of the, like, 3D graphical world or whatever, like with 3D Zelda games. It gets a little more confusing when you freaking have, yeah, that's what I thought. Get away from me! Also, I think there's boulders that fall down. Yep. I'm getting chased like a madman. I'm just hoping I can make it to the start screen, my dude, and retrace my steps. I'm gonna try and go get some, uh... Ooh! Stay away! Oh, that makes it easy. I believe I keep my stuff. If I'm not mistaken. Yeah, I keep my stuff, but I freaking have to go back to three hearts. That's no biggie. Although I am a... It just... Another thing is... Oh, I did a no-no and I killed him. Oh, well. Come on up, blue tech type. Nope, that's okay. I'll go kill your brethren. Oh, yeah. Three more. Give me another one. Give me another one. Give me another one. So you kind of got to wait for them to jump. Oh. Come on. You know you want it. Oh, yeah. Uh, dang it, that doesn't help me. Oh, I'm so close. Oh, just let me get it. Let me get it. Let me get it. Nope. Okay. Alright, if you're going to play it that way, then. I also... Mm, okay. Oh, okay. Whatever. I also apologize uh, in advance for uh, this video. Probably won't have any of the dungeon. It'll probably be all preparation. Preparation. Yeah, we got another one. We have 60 rupees. Yeah, this, it really is important that we prepare ourselves. It makes the first dungeon a whole lot easier. Because I don't, like, I don't mind showing that I'm bad at, at games. But this was Legend of Zelda. This is my jam, dude. I'm not going to be punked. Stuttered there a little bit. I'm not going to be punked by one of my favorite games. All right. We're going up north. And then... We take in a left. And this is the story we want to bet. See, they don't want none. These Octoroks. They, they're crazy. Buy something, will ya? Well, I'll be. I'll take this blue candle. Watch this. Poof! You can only do it once per screen. I should also mention that. Do 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 do! Such a great song. Like, I feel like almost all Zelda songs are absolutely beautiful. Alright, we're gonna wanna go left. We're gonna go up. We're gonna keep going left. And. Okay, yeah, I was making sure I do this right. Ooh, ooh. 
Oh, look at that. Blocked, baby. And then we're going to want to burn this spot right here. Oh. See, I do remember some stuff. Hmm. Nope. I, wow, that was a oof right there, boys. I said I remembered stuff. That was a normal heart. One, two, three, four, five. You're gonna, you wanna burn the fifth one from the... There you go. Yeah, because I knew in my head, I was like, I know there's something there, but, like, my brain didn't tell me, oh, no. You know, I had it written down, too, that there was something there. But my brain was like, oh, this is this has just got to be the, you know, the actual heart container, the important heart. Uh, no, that was not the case. Get back, get back, get back, get back. Oh, you got schooled, kid. All right. For this, you need 90 rupees. So, since we obviously do not have 90 rupees, what we have to do is, we have to go rupee getting. So, for this, we need to get first to the area in the very top right corner. See how you have some kind of what's a map in the top right corner? Oh, get back. Get back. Get back. Get back. Get back. I got a rupee. Oh, no. Your green little square is basically where... Get back. That's basically where Link is at. Um, yeah, so... You want to try to not take any damage, even though some damage getting is going to be downright inevitable. I promise you I'm probably going to die on my way up here. Get back. I swear if I get really close and then I die, that's going to make me super mad. Oh, I should have grabbed that bomb. That way even if I died, I would have came home with something. I think I'm getting up here. Nope, that's not it. Yes, I think it's up here I want to go. No, that's, that's not it either. I guess I can get this while I'm here. Show this to the old woman. I mean, it's just kind of an old paper. She opens up her shop and gets you potions, I think. Well, uh, yeah, not complete. Oh, oh no! I was almost there. Gosh dang it. Well, that's fun. Uh... I'm gonna cut ahead to where I get to the top right corner. I'll see you guys there. Alright guys, so here basically, if you can tell, I'm right here on the wall, you're gonna wanna come here, like right there in between the tree and then this little thing, and then you're gonna wanna go through there. And then you come down here, and this guy's like, hey, it's a secret to everybody. 
but not us. Boom! And you get a hundred rupees. And no, you can't do it again. I don't think it works like that. That'd be cool if it did, but it'd be kind of cheating. Let's see, you basically come back and he's gone. So yeah. And you pretty much would never have figured this out unless you looked this up. I know it's, I knew it was here because I, I mean, I've played the game before and I have experience, but as far as the exact location, I did look it up because obviously that's just a weird random thing. I guess if you didn't want to look it up, you could just randomly hug the wall and just keep trying to run up. That's a good kind of strategy, I guess, but you know, I wouldn't, I wouldn't do it if I were you. Also, sometimes I will die on purpose just because it's easier to get to the start screen. Because the map, for being the first game, is really big. I mean, it's... You would think it's not going to be that big. But, oh, like a 2D game. Like, a lot of it's the same. But if you actually explore it all, it's fairly big. Alright. We're going to go get ourselves more rupees. Okay, what we're going to do now, if you're at the start screen, you know, coming with me... You're gonna wanna go up one, and then you're gonna wanna go left four. Okay, so that's one. This is two. Oh. Three. Ooh, ooh. And then four. Alright, so now you gotta burn. Actually, I think I went. I didn't. I don't think I went enough. Yes, this makes sense. Here we go. I was gonna say I think I lost count. It didn't make sense. I was gonna say surely that couldn't be. Nope. Shoot, I gotta come back. I did it wrong. Sometimes it's r really picky about like where you. Oh, get away from me! I swear, if I die right here. Yes, there we go. Sometimes it's such a butthole. It's a secret to everybody. It's not a secret. You literally say it over and over again. It's not a secret. Now we have 208 rupees. This is a lot for the game. It's pretty good, actually. Alright. Now what we're going to want to get. I know it's be it would be very tempting to go get the magical shield. But I promise you, there's something even better we can go get. If I don't die. It's called the blue ring. You don't need it to beat the game, you don't really need it at all. But, for two reasons, we, got, we are gonna want it. And I died. So, that's good. It's, it's all good. It's all good. We have three more lives. Uh, if, I can't decide because... Uh, there's a cheat where I can, you know, have, you know, just not take damage, which is going to be really easy because this game is, it's super hard not to take damage because it's just so, it requires up close combat for pretty much every enemy, especially starting out, but I sometimes use that as my mode of transportation uh, because it's just easier that way. Also hard. We're gonna wanna go up one and to the right one. Oh, you got blocked, kid. Oh, you got blocked. As Anthony Davis would say, blocked. Alright, let me kill these guys first. Oof. Oh, double kill! Yeah, boy! confusing okay so I went they told me to go up and then to the right but it said there should be an armos uh fair I don't want to go there yet that's that's for later there is obviously no no armos here hmm. 
I think maybe he was... Maybe it was the left. <laughs> nope. Oh, also this game gets really glitchy whenever you freaking... There's too many enemies on this screen at once. Did I just come from here? What? I'm confused. Oh, no, I know what to do here, but it's not... It's not important right now. Alright, so I decided, um, ooh. yeah, that's right, I decided apparently you can't get the blue ring yet, I don't think, it's just kind of, it's an out of the way thing, this guide was not right in showing me where the blue ring was, um, so yeah, that was nice, I had to figure that out in the middle of recording, I really should have tested it out, but, like, I had used this guy before, so I thought, oh, it's gonna be trustworthy. It's literally, like, I don't use it a lot, only when I really need to remember where something is. Because I've played this game many times, but it's, the last time it's been a while. It's been about a year and a half-ish, a year or two. Which, for me, like, gamer, that that's, is a long time. That's, you know, I normally don't go very long without playing games. Especially ones that I'm about to record, but I just thought of this one. I was like, hey, I'll go do it. So, never mind. We are, we are actually, in fact, getting the shield. Okay. So basically, what we're gonna want to do is, we're gonna want to go to the right, and then we're gonna want to go up one, and then, hang on. Oh no! I pressed the wrong button. I, found, I just decided to get that ferret because I mean, apparently they come back, so I was like, alright, whatever. So, normally the magical shield is a price of about eh, 130-ish, but we're going to get it for 9, oh my gosh, stop it. Okay, that's not working out. So, oh, there we go. Oh, I found 30 rupees on accident. Apparently, I can't find anything. Hmm. All right. Well. We have enough, I was trying to get the freaking shield cheaper to save money, but apparently that is just not possible because I have freaking terrible guides. Literally any other Zelda game I could remember what stuff is, but it's just the way the screens are and everything, it's so like, oh, like left, right, it's not even like locations because if they gave you the location you would not even be able to know like where the heck is that so you they basically have to say when they give directions and this is for anywhere you have to go in base of 
you know, left, right, up, down, north, east, west, south, you know, it's not easy things to do. So, instead, we're getting the magical shield for 160. It's a little bit bigger. Didn't really want to spend that much money, but, oh well, it's worth it. No biggie. Well, I guess that'll do it for today. I'll return to the start screen since that's where it all began. That'll be it for today. Sorry about the whole not knowing where anything and everything is at. I'll try and fix that up. Um, that was a little frustrating for, I think, the both of us. All of us. Uh, so yeah, that's gonna be it for today. I'll see you guys on the next video for some more Legend of Zelda. And I can guarantee you we will take down the first dungeon. That's a promise. I'll see you guys later.